Hey, this is Betty Kempa, and I'm an executive career change coach. This is part four of my video training series on how to land a job during turbulent times. You know, somebody reached out to me the other day and they said, Betty, the job that I was interviewing for is now on a hiring freeze. What do I do now? So I want to tell you what you don't do. You don't put your job search strategy into a hiring freeze, no matter what. In fact, you need to do the opposite right now. You need to accelerate your job search efforts. Now, why is that? Even before COVID, on average, we were seeing 250 applicants per role. And now that number is only going to increase. So you better believe that you need to be on the top of that pack. You need to get your foot in the door early and your marketing material needs to be on point. Okay, this is your career. This is your future livelihood. Besides health and, and your family, this is right up there with one of the most important things you can do for yourself right now, okay? So in my training videos that I've done so far, I've covered the six steps that it takes to accelerate your job search in times of turbulence. I've talked about the resume, the cover letter, your LinkedIn profile, and your elevator pitch. Now today I wanna dive into virtual, tra uh, virtual networking, step five. Okay, now, now is the best time to network. Professionals are quarantined at home. They've got extra time to talk. And not only that, building these relationships takes time. Okay, you need to plant seeds and water them over time so that once a job opens up, you're top of mind. I also need you to find ways to be seen as a giver and a server now versus a taker later. And what I mean by taker is reaching out cold to somebody once you need something, okay? Now, there are two ways of getting your foot in the door, after the job gets posted or before the job gets posted. As you can imagine, uh, number two is, is your best bet, right? So I have strategies for getting your foot in the door after the job gets posted, and that'll be covered in my six-week job search accelerator program. But today, I wanna talk about the five steps it takes to get your foot in the door before the job even gets posted, okay? Let's talk about that. All right. So step one is target list. Target list, um, you're gonna create a target company list. So regardless of whether or not they're currently posting any openings, especially with hiring freezes, the goal here is to get on your target company's radar before they even post a job or to get a referral for a job at one of these target companies. Now, how do you come up with this list? Well, of course, you're gonna brainstorm, and I also want you to be thinking of, when you look at the list that you have, your brainstorm, what are their competitors? You also might wanna add them to your list. Um, great place to work list. LinkedIn is a great place. Um, in my six-week job search accelerator program, I'm gonna give you the full rundown of all the resources that you can use to create an impressive target company list. But the more you can put on your list, the better, but you wanna shoot for at least 20, okay? Um, step two is your inner circle. Okay, so your inner circle, you need to empower your inner circle to help you. Okay, you remember that scene from Jerry Maguire where Tom Cruise's character tells Cuba Gooding Jr.'s character, help me help you, right? Remember that? I, I want you to imagine that your immediate network your friends, families, and, co and your friends, family, and colleagues are saying the same thing to you. They want to help you, but they don't know how to help you. Okay, so you want to leverage your inner circle, your friends, family, and colleagues who already know, like, and trust you and want the best for you. Okay, so what you're going to do is share your target company list with them and ask if they happen to know anyone who works at any of these companies. And the request is, would you be willing to virtually introduce me so I can learn more about the company culture? Okay, now think outside of the box with who you ask here. Don't discount anyone. One gal was chatting with her hairdresser about the company she was targeting, and he piped up and said, hey, you know, I have a client who works at one of those companies, and he was able to connect the two of them. She developed a relationship with that person, and down the road, lo and behold, they referred her to a position at that company, okay? So the moral of the story is don't discount anyone in your immediate network. You never know who they know, 
right? Your network does not need to directly be working at that company or in that industry. They just need to know someone who is. Okay, so in my Job Search Accelerator program, I'm gonna be giving you a one pager worksheet. You're gonna fill that out and I'm gonna be providing you a script that you're gonna be giving to your immediate network, um, explaining how they can help you. Step three is request a chat. Okay, so at this point, um, once your inner circle connects you to this person at the target company, you're going to request a 15 minute virtual coffee chat. You're going to share, hey, you know, I'm a huge fan of XYZ company because of the following reasons. And really, I'd just love to learn more about your experience there and a little bit more about the company culture, right? So, of course, you're going to connect via Zoom or phone. And um, side note, this person who works at your target company does not need to be the hiring manager or a recruiter or anything like that. I mean, bonus points if they are, but um, they, they don't even need to work in your target de department. This person is really more your sponsor. There's somebody within the four walls of your target company, right, who down the road has the potential to refer you for a role or connect you to the hiring manager. So we're gonna take this one step at a time. Step four is plant the seed. So plant the seed, um, meaning have the chat, have the virtual coffee chat. I want you to approach this coming from a place of genuine curiosity and service, right? So of course you're gonna repeat, you know, that you're interested, why you're interested in the company and that the purpose of this conversation is just to learn about the company culture and that person's experience working there. This is a really non-aggressive way to just build the relationship, right? Versus, hey, can you get me a job? Now, in my six-week job search accelerator program, I'm gonna have a script, of course, that I will be providing you to have for this very conversation. Now, at the end of the conversation, of course, you're gonna thank them. And I want you to ask, how can I support you right now? From the smallest thing, um, maybe making an introduction for them or um, even to something bigger like a pro bono project, right? And then end the conversation with, hey, is, is there anyone else you recommend I speak with to learn more about this company? Keep the ball rolling. Okay, step five is water the seed. Okay, so watering the seed, building the relationship, right? Now this is the most important part of this whole process. So after the call, sending them a thank you note and continuing to build the relationship. Follow up with anything you promise that you do to support any of their endeavors, send them random articles that reference something that maybe you guys talked about um, that you think they'd enjoy. If they post on LinkedIn, comment, engage, keep the relationship alive, right? Now down the road, you'll explore if they're comfortable connecting you with the hiring manager of the target department or referring you for a role. Now imagine multiplying this effort, right? Imagine a list of 20 target companies distributed to all of your immediate network who already know, like, and trust you, and how many potentially valuable conversations you could be having right now, okay? Imagine who will be first in mind when a role opens up at that company. Or once you see a role posted, you'll have a list of people to reach out to, right? So this strategy I shared with you today, it's a piece of the pie when it comes to virtual networking. There are many strategies I'll be providing you to help you get your foot in the door and virtually network in times like these when it matters most. All right, guys, I hope you found this mini training helpful. I'm gonna drop a link in the comment below for you to check out the six-week Job Search Accelerator program. In this program, I'm here to serve as your mentor. So you're gonna be getting templates, um, beautiful matching resume and cover letter templates, and I'm gonna be coaching you through how to develop this marketing material, how to optimize your LinkedIn profile, create an elevator pitch, virtually network and virtually interview, okay? Side note, um, if you end up signing on by end of day Thursday, April 16th, you're gonna get a bonus training on fierce negotiation strategy. This particular strategy landed one of my clients an additional $15,000 on top of her offer. So this is a tool you don't wanna pass up. All right, guys, see you soon.